All right, so let's say you have a profile on Bitwarden and you wish to change the password for the profile. So what you're going to do is to head over to the website first. I already have the website loaded. For you, it can be Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, any website. All you have to do is just head over to security and then you head to where you can change your password. So an ideal website will ask you for your current password, which should be the password you have stored on Bitwarden. So I'm going to head back to Bitwarden and copy the password. You don't have to always head back to copy the password. You can also autofill the password, but I'll be making another video about that. All right, I'm going to enter the password and now it is asking for a new password. So now you're going to head back to Bitwarden. You're going to select the account you wish to change the password for. So you tap here, then you tap edit. And this is the username and this is the password, but we want to create a new password. So all you have to do is just tap here. And then it's going to ask you if you are sure because if you do this it's going to delete the password you have here and then put a new one in so tap yes all right so a new password will be generated it has not been applied yet so you can customize it to how you want i like it when the password is, is up to 16 characters and then i like having special characters as well and um up to two numbers and uh two special characters so you can customize this to how you want, but I like it this way. So after you get the password, you tap here to copy it. After you copy it, you tap here. You must do this part. If you don't do this part, it's going to get lost. So you tap here to save it. Now the password has been created and finally you have to tap here. So after saving it, you go back to the website. Because the password is already copied from the website, you can just paste it here twice. And then you tap change password now it says password changed so you have successfully changed the password on bitwarden as well as the website all right if this video was helpful you can let me know in the comments or just give it a like and yeah if you have questions you can also leave them in the comments i'll see you in the next video